Shenzhou 15 spacecraft is now opening its uh, node cabin at this point. So, Professor Yang, let's come back to the studio. So, what are they doing right now? So, it is the door is open at this point. Okay, they, is gave, it? they gave each other a hug. Oh, they have met, and that is a big hug. Yes. Yeah. So, so is it like your expectation? Was it like that before? Uh, well, uh, yes, uh, you know that uh, just uh, just uh, several minutes before uh, Mr. Chen Dong opened the front hatch of the uh, of the node, the, the node cabin, and yes, uh, and Mr. Fei Jinlong opened the hatch of the uh, orbital module of Shenzhou uh, 15 spaceship. Mm -hmm. So and is this like is this like your expectation that how the two crews would meet? Is this like one by one? It is not like they would come. You know, and meet all together like the two. Uh, as we already discussed, uh, we have a crew transfer uh, crew, crew transfer channel uh, mm -hmm. between the two vehicles, and it's uh, a little bit narrow. The inner, as I mentioned, the inner diameter of this crew transportation tunnel is about zero point eight five meters. Mm -hmm. So only one person can go uh, one by one. Okay. Uh, so that's the reason why uh, uh, first the commander meet each other. So that. The two commanders have met now, and the next and the next two crew members will come in pretty soon. Exactly. And what what will happen next? What will happen next? And I think uh, next uh, maybe uh, the uh, the other two members, Mr. Deng Qingming and Mr. Zhang Lu, will uh, enter the station one by one. And after that, I have heard that the uh, the Shenzhou 15 crew have already brought some presents from Earth. Yes. As I said just now, <laughs> and what's your expect? What are you expecting? Well, you know that uh, it depends on what they like, and usually, you know that uh, on the International Space Station, uh, usually uh, the the fresh food is very uh, favorite choices for them. Yes, probably some fresh fruits. Maybe some uh, background information about Shenzhou 15 crew and the Shenzhou 15. Uh, manned space station is the last flight bound for China Space Station this year and the final task during the construction stage of the station. And the crew includes Fei Junlong, who is the uh, commander, commander exactly. of this mission of uh, Shenzhou 15. And of course, after that, Deng Qingming and Zhang Lu will follow. And someone, who is the next one going in? Exactly. So in? on the left of the screen, you can see uh, is a video from the camera mounted in the uh, Wentian module. Mm -hmm. You may notice uh, uh, the space bicycle. Mm -hmm. I think uh, that is Deng Qingming, right? At this yes. point, because yes. also the another uh, another warm hug. Another warm hug. Uh, they're saying that is some big exclamation. It's a great to exactly. see you. Exactly. So favorite. maybe in the future we will form this tradition. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They have already met officially at this point. Yes. So Deng Qingming has uh, been waiting for about 25 years, 24 years, over two decades, and finally he has made his dream come true at this point. So what will happen next? So Professor John, you are still with us online on Skype at this point. So Professor John, what will happen next? I mean, the, when it comes to the rotation, they will spend about a week's time on the China's Tiangong space station. What will happen next? What do they need to do? Right. Uh, so, so in the next, for the next five days, uh, during this handover period, um, the, the last crew, the Shenzhou 14 crew, will still be, uh, be in charge in, this, in that sense. Uh, and then they would uh, sort of tell the new crew um, what has been changed. Um, you know, uh, they have done the major structural construction work for the space station, but the interior, is, it's, it's like building a house. Um, now it's down to the final sort of... Uh, soft touches, the, uh, the interior decorations and that sort of thing. As, as you can imagine, it's, it's, a, it's a pretty big uh, space station for three people to, to look after. Uh, there are a lot of like, life support systems, everything, and then a lot of experiments. There are, there's going to be 24 racks inside, nearly 50 uh, external points. So some of the experiments are already up there. Um, so they've been doing those. Uh, right, they need to... Uh, to tell the new crew, you know, what they have done, what, what things they have changed for the experiments. Mm -hmm. Being experiments, they are unpredictable. Um, so they, 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 they have to change things on the go. And, and they have to tell the new crew what has changed, what, what talks they have changed uh, differently. And, and that really has to be done face to face. Um, so, so, so the next five days, here, they will be doing that sort of uh, very detailed briefing. Um, yeah, there will be plenty of experiments that they're going to do in microgravity. So it is a, such a party over here. We can see from the uh, 
live footage of there and we are looking at the meeting of the two crews, Shenzhou 14 and the Shenzhou 15 and they are the Shenzhou 14 crew members including Chen Dong, Liu Yang and Cai Xizhe and the Shenzhou 15 crew manned the space mission will include Fei Junlong, Deng Qingming and Zhang Lu. They are having a big party over there. What are they doing at this point? I think they have, uh, what is that? That is a walkie-talkie. They are talking to Beijing at this point, are they? Quite right. And you, you know that uh, just uh, from the social media today, I read that uh, at this moment, at this right moment, the China has the largest number of astronauts in outer space. You know, they, they do have seven astronauts on board the uh, International Space Station, but you know that they come from different countries. Mm -hmm. So only we China have six astronauts in outer space now. Mm -hmm. I think they are talking to Beijing at this point, right? And they have, I think he is just saying that we have seen something and we are learning from you, something like that. So yes, yes, uh, they just uh, say uh, greeting to each other, and you, you know that uh, this uh, is a video uh, getting from the camera mounted in the Wentian module. Mm -hmm. So they because are they are in Wentian module at this exactly. point. Exactly. Ah, uh, you may notice uh, the space bicycle. Uh, yeah. Originally, this space bicycle is located in the Tianhe Wan Kong module. But when the Wentian module is docked to the station, it was moved to this Wentian module. Mm. It looks like a big party of there, and the one, the lady who is talking at this point, is Liu Yang, right? Yeah, and yeah. Liu Yang is the first female astronaut in space in 2012 on the Shenzhou 9 mission. So they are taking the uh, walkie-talkie one by one, and they have been talking to Beijing. And at this point, they are trying to tell Beijing that everything is okay at this everything point. Everything is okay. And mm -hmm. you may notice that just before the launch mm -hmm. of Shenzhou 15 uh, manned spaceship yesterday, the Shenzhou 14 crew uh, did an, uh, a very important job. It is to change the station mm -hmm. from the status of three crew mm -hmm. to six crew. Uh, to six crew. Mm -hmm. uh, the, main, the change mainly located in the what we call the regenerative uh, environmental control and life support system. Mm -hmm. I know, think they are going to take a family photo at this point, but of course they have to anchor themselves to stabilize themselves yes, right yes. in space. Uh, it's easy for Mr. Fei Jinlong, but uh, a little bit difficult for Mr. Deng Qingming and Mr. Zhang Lu because they have never been to outer space before. But they have been going through a lot of training, so they should be get, they should be used to the environment, I think. Uh, so they are taking a selfie. One, two, three. So they are saying that China is uh, Tiangong Space Station, right? And that can this meet your really expectation a, all the time. Yes, this is really a historical <laughs> moment for we, yeah. all, all Chinese people.